Hey guys, it's Gus and Carlos from Hardware Unplugged and today we're going to be unboxing the Artisan Hyatic Cool. But before we get started, please make sure to hit that like button to show support and if you want to see more content like this, don't forget to subscribe. With that being said, let's begin. Alright, so we have the Artisan Co or Cool, what is it? Co? Yeah, Co? Co? Yeah, Co? Artisan Co? And all right, I think this is the last. No, we need the Haya, uh, Hayate Atsu. That's the, the last mouse pad we need to finally complete all the freaking artists and mouse pads. So, all right, so I heard some interesting things about this one. I heard mm -hmm. the X and Y on the Hayate Co mm -hmm. is different. So, kind of like the M510 and the Eve mouse pad we mm -hmm. ran into recently. Um, so, it's pretty, it's gonna be interesting to check this out. Now, this mouse pad, right off the bat, no. Did they give us a wrong one because like the color, you know what I mean? It's like orange and then like oh no 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 yeah the, yeah from the logo. But okay no. yeah yeah. Just by looking at it, it kind of looks Mine's like zero. The, right a little bit, but you know what? But you know what? This feel it with your hands. It it honestly it, it almost looks like a hand. It does almost feel like a hand. Right, even looking at it, it almost looks like a hand. But you know what? It's like a slower hand. The closer I, mean, I look at it. Yeah, there's like some not exactly like a heen. Like there's like something different. I can't tell exactly, but it doesn't quite exactly 100% like the heen, but kind of looks like it. You know what this reminds me of? Mm. Reminds me of kind of like the Equate, kind of, or like the Equate Plus yeah. type of like, like look, I don't know. Yeah. That's what it reminds me of. I, I don't know. It's very weird. Interesting. Feel the X and Y though with your hand, and then. Oh, I, I actually like that. Left and right, I feel like it's slower. Sand, almost like sandpaper. Yeah. yeah. And it's slower going up and down. It's kind of smooth and nice. Yeah, it's Ooh. effortless. Let's try with the moss pad. I love those. I love the bases in this thing, dude. Here, try that. Uh, I've never heard of this pad, on, honestly. I've never heard of the cool one. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Cool. So I thought this mouse pad was gonna be a lot slower, you know, because you feel it with your hands, too, like yeah, yeah. it, you know, it feels like roughish, yeah. kind of, like, you know yeah. what I mean, like slow. But using core pads, right? Yes. Uh, on them, on the mouse, uh, on top of the mouse pad. Yeah. It's really not that slow. No, it's kind it of a little bit on the fast side, a, a little bit. Yeah. It feels um, good though. It does feel good, yeah. honestly. Ah, uh, I'm. Uh, it's 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 interesting because this pad feels like a pad that we've tried. I but I just can't put my, you know, I can't put my thought on it you know what i mean like yeah finger in it yeah yeah no this mouse pad feels pretty damn pretty good i'm gonna lie i like that uh the x and y how the it's smoothly going up yeah i like that but like i also like the resistance on yeah the, uh, on the x exactly so, Ooh, this mouse what? pad feels good honestly how come people haven't talked about this one i have no idea i have no i think people don't like it i think that's i think that's the what i've heard but i'm not sure All right, but well. uh you know what dude this mouse pad it interests me. So it does. Let's go ahead and take it for a spin and see what we think about this mouse pad because so far, so good. Yep. So yeah, let's go ahead and take it for a spin and we'll be right back. He's 
Alright, so we've been testing this mouse pad for like two, three weeks, dude, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we took that. I was specifically, I had it for like yeah. two weeks. You had it for like I had three weeks. Right? I had it yeah. for a week. I was playing using it for a whole right, week. Right, so total three weeks used, right? And we were using it for so long because I just <laughs> don't get it. Like, I don't get this mouse pad. Like, this yeah. mouse pad, like, the X and Y are so drastically different. Drastically different. That when I'm trying to play any kind of game, tag shooters or freaking Apex Legends, fast paced FPS. Tracking just throws my aim off so much, so much. I don't, I don't get how this mouse pad is popular. Oh, actually, no, scratch that. I don't get how some people can like it. But that's just me, right? That's just us. Because mm -hmm. the X and Y are just so drastically different. Like, I could see why this mouse pad is not really talked about. Exactly. You know, like, exactly. now I get it, right? Yes. Like, you know. It's like, not the most popular one. So, yeah. Let's talk about price, right? How much, how much is it? It's the same thing, right? It's all yeah, like artists. 60 bucks, like, 65 bucks. 60 bucks, 65, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, do I think it's still worth at, at that price? Yes, because you're still getting the quality, quality yeah. of artists and pads. Yeah. not going to get affected, you know, by humidity. Yeah. You know, the base is really, you know, superior. Yeah. And to be honest with you, this texture here, I've really never felt this texture here like this. Because if you use, you know, like your fingers, right? I mean, uh, you know, uh, you know uh, if, you use, uh, if you use your fingernails, yeah. Um, it feels hard, right? It feels hard. Like, use your fingernails. It yeah. feels hard. When you use your actual, you know, your actual uh, yeah. fingers, it feels really, like, clothy, really soft. Like, yeah. Again, it's a very unique surface, honestly. Yeah. It really is. The only thing that I don't like about it is that, again, left and right is so slow. Up and down is extremely fast. And, dude, when I was playing Apex Legends in this, specifically when people are arcing, I noticed that whenever you're trying to arc, yeah, whenever you're you trying know, to track, yeah, you, you know, whenever, you know, like the revenants, you know, the, you know, the revenants yeah. and octanes, you know, like jump out at you, you know, uh, getting them up whenever they're flying is cool and all, but you know how sometimes, you know, whenever that they yeah, arc, jump, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. whenever they do, you know, like second jump, that, that right there doing that, uh, good luck landing your shots with this pad because it's super inconsistent, dude. I it's, just couldn't get used to it, yeah. It's definitely a pad that, if you're gonna get used to it, I, I feel like this is gonna be one of the most difficult paths for you to, for your brain to adjust to because yeah. it is so drastically different. And I think you were telling me that people, they do like it, but they like it turning around, you know what I mean? Like on the side, yeah. so that the left is faster yeah. and the up and down slower. Yeah. But then you're losing, you know, more yeah, width space. and, and yeah. space. And, and I could do that, but like, that's not what, this mouse pad wasn't designed like that, you know what I mean? I wouldn't use it like this, the way it was intended yeah. to be used. And maybe it, Maybe this mouse pad works on like your. Maybe if you can get used to this, maybe your accuracy will improve when you go back to your other mouse pads. But maybe, but I I can't tell, man. Like I, I use it for like <clears throat> two weeks and then go back to uh, immediately as soon as I went to my rating. Yeah, instantly started playing yeah, better. Yeah, me too. Instantly me started too. playing better. Like this mouse pad, I don't know who it's for. We just don't know who it's for. Um. Like, if you like what you hear, I, I guess, yeah, right? Yeah, so, XMR is drastically different. Well, left and right is really slow, yeah. up and down is really fast. If you think that you want that in a mouse pad, I say, I guess give it a try, right? Yeah. But then again, you know, it is $70, so, again, you really have to make sure if this mouse is going to be for you, dude. Again, yeah. it's 60 70 bucks. Um, So, uh, same thing like any other, like, oh, RZ pad. Yeah. You have to be sure what you want to get. Yes. RZ pads are not a pad that's like, oh, I heard so and so and so say that's yeah. good. I'm gonna go buy it because yeah. I'm telling you, like our pads are really expensive, and once yeah. you have it, and if you don't like it, you're kind of screwed. You're gonna have to stick exactly. with it, exactly. Right? And, th and there's no real alternative to this. You know, I can no. say if you want to try a Heen, get the Old Infinity. If you want to try a Rating, get the MPC 50. Yeah, this this uh, one is X and Y is so really different. It's like it's yeah. I don't know who it's for. Um, yeah, I can see why people don't talk about it. I can see. Why yeah, people don't talk about me too. It. Oh, okay. <laughs> to put it into perspective. Um, this has to be my least favorite Arsene yes. pad. Like, 100%. by far, 100%. my least favorite. Yeah. Not, now, again, just because I say that it's my least favorite, dude, if you guys want to go ahead and say, oh, hey, you know, well, I like the Arsene pad, good, dude, you know, yeah. I'm not, I'm not, yeah. you know, I'm not, I'm not saying that, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, That's if this you, is your man. end game, go for it, dude. The, yeah, like, good for you, dude. More power to you. Yeah. But out of all the ones that we've tried personally, yeah. this beating, like, the Zero, this no. beating, like, you know, Rating. like, the Ian, he shoot this beating the Rating. Guy. At least I was able to play with the shooting kind. You know what I mean? Uh, At least I was able to play with the shooting kind. That's a good video because yeah. me and him do have a different, you know, like debates on the yeah. shooting kind yeah. and this one. 
Uh, but you know, I guess we'll you know yeah, we'll, we'll talk more about that. Yeah, for yeah for the for the artist list, right? Yeah. Uh, but yeah, this 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 one, you know, um, I was really excited to try it at first. After trying it, I'm like, mm. I can see what nobody talking about it. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Now I know um, why. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Links to everything will be down below. This is Gus and Carlos from Hardware Unplugged, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.